patience was pushed to the limit Tuesday morning. For Jason Solorino. Power went out at, yeah, right around 7.15. When 8.15 rolled around, I was like, well, we'll give it another 15 minutes or so. 9 o'clock rolls around, 9.15, 9.30. We anticipated it happening, but did not anticipate it being three plus hours. Every hour the outage dragged on, his home and others on the block were getting colder. There's just really no warning. But he says there was no getting through to Evergy to report the problem. Well, from Armor Hills here to neighborhoods all across the Kansas City region, I talked to numerous people today who say that they were just frustrated. They couldn't get through to Evergy to report their extended power outages. Facing unprecedented rolling outages, the company told customers to call if power was out more than an hour. But customers we talked to say they were hung up on several times. And online, Evergy says issues are due to high traffic. It's funny, uh, you know, they don't really have any trouble contacting you if they need to talk to you about your bill or something of that nature. Uh, but when you want to talk to them, it, it's a challenge. In Armor Hills, Haley Harrison, KNBC 9.